Guangzhou is one of the most developed cities of China. It is ranked at the third place in regarding to the urban comprehensive competitiveness and its gross domestic product. In addition to this, Guangzhou is ranked at the sixth and eighth place for its population and per capita GDP, respectively. Guangzhou, which is located on south of China, is one of the large cities that are heading for the housing issues. To figure out the issue, the government provided approximately 3.2 million yuan for investment of fixed assets, including housing investment. In 1998, the comfortable housing project work units were constructed to serve the housing issue. Well, without mortgage loans, the income of low-income households was still not high enough to cover the price of those units. After recognizing the difficulties of those households. The government decided to develop the housing allowance scheme as an independent housing management center. The housing allowance was allowed to use funds to invest in finance projects. As the capital city of Guangdong Province, Guangzhou invested over 1.37 billion dollars to construct 20 affordable housing projects. Across eight different districts in 2011, the government also maximized the usage of spare land by implementing the relevant policies to developers or other organizations. The HAS plays a significant role in reconstructing existing housing projects, and the action taken by the government. Enormously contributed the affordable housing development in Guangzhou. In 2011, the majority of those families of poverty have lived in the affordable houses. Besides, the living conditions of those public houses have been developed to a reasonable level. As one of the large cities of China. Guangzhou may be suffering serious issues regard to the following factors if the government do not take any action, and due to the importance of the role of Guangzhou in China and even the world towards to business trading and communications, the economy of China and other countries will also be heavily impacted. As recommended, there should be more opportunities of obtaining mortgages or more other financial funds for housing loan provided to low-income groups, and the installment period can be extended to 20 to 25 years to increase the affordability of households.